Today at North Blue Water House, we're looking around this incredible Mercedes-Benz C63S AMG, finished in selenite grey with 19-inch forged cross-spoke alloy wheels in matte black, and the red AMG brake calipers sat just behind. An incredibly high spec on this example, we've got the carbon exterior packs. So you can see them there on the front splitter, and then on the wing here as well. And down onto the side skirt. Also got carbon mirror caps. Excellent condition throughout, just over 48,000 miles and seven services in total. Very well maintained example. We've got further carbon around the rear here. I can't stress how rare this carbon is to have this on the C63 from factory. We've also got the tyres averaging 6.5 mil. We've also got the pan roof, 360 cam, high beam assist. It's a really high spec example overall. And then we've got the upgraded grille on the front. You can see the camera there above the Mercedes badge. So we'll take a quick look inside now. So just starting off with the passenger side, we've got the power fold door mirrors. You see the little triangle in the corner there for the blind spot assist. Moving on to the door card, all in excellent condition. We've got the black leather with white stitching and the brushed aluminium trim. Memory seats for driver and passenger, which are heated, and the Burmeister sound system there as well. Moving inside, the AMG tread plates and AMG floor mats and the full bucket seats with white piping. And you can see the pan roof and rear sunroof just up there as well. And then lots of lights in the cabin. Further carbon inside for the interior trim. Just moving into the rear now. Again, door cards all in excellent condition, as are the backs bucket seats. Looking incredible. And the rear seats also in excellent condition with the ISOFIX points just down there and the silver seat belts throughout. And just looking in the boot space now, we've got the electric tailgate, as you can see, all in good condition in the boot space. We've also got the first aid kit, netting, pump and tire weld in there as well. And just looking at the rear driver's side now, again door cards all in good condition, as our backs front seats. And lots of light in there from the open sunroof and the rear seats in good condition as well really really clean example and finally the driver's side now so we've got the window and mirror controls just here again we've got the memory seats which are heated with the Burmeister sound system and then the boot release just down there moving inside we can see driver's seat is held up incredibly well Still in fantastic conditions. This is where you expect to see the most wear on the driver's bolster. And it still looks fantastic, as does the steering wheel. So we'll jump in and get it started now. So we're just in the driver's seat and we've got just over 48,000 miles on the clock. Push button to start. Just make you smile every morning. We've got the original book pack over there in the glove box. And as you can see, this incredible carbon fiber trim, really nice setting off the interior, making it feel really special in here. You can see the open and roof there as well. Let's close that up while the engine warms up. So one of the main screens on here is the AMG screen so you can see the engine oil and gearbox temperature currently in blue. Once that turns white then you can put your foot down a little bit more. You can see we got the assistance graphic on there as well just for the attention assist. Moving on to the main screen. We got the large screen navigation on there. 
DAV radio and Bluetooth of course. see some of the features we've got for the folding mirrors and the lighting inside as well also see we've got multiple driving modes down here so you can see suspension and for the gearbox into manual and then the AMG exhaust over on the right hand side go through some of these we've got sport sport plus you can just hit the exhaust note change in there and being the s we've also got the race mode as well you can see it changing onto the dash can also set up the individual drive mode let's go back to individual click on adapt and you can have the suspension in comfort with the engine in race for example so it's more manageable on the uk roads so really nice feature having that there also got the dual climate control down in the center here. Turn that off for a moment. And then back onto the clocks here. We've also got the automatic high beam assist. See that coming on at the top there. It's so really good for the winter months or nighttime driving. And we've got the twin cup holders just in the center there. The beautiful little analog clock central as well, really setting off the interior. So I think that's most of the features inside now. In fact, we do also have 360 camera, so you can see that in the photo bay on the left hand side and the rear cam on the right there as well. Again, one of the highest specs I think you'll come across online at the moment. So we'll let the vehicle warm up and then we'll see what it sounds like. So guys, we'll let the vehicle warm up and we're going to start off in comfort mode. Just fantastic, that V8. You can hear the valves open up there into Sport Plus and race mode. So guys, that's the end of the video. I hope that's been informative. Any questions or queries, please do get in touch with the sales team. Our contact details should be on the screen now. Thank you.